Hey everyone, George from Elite Motor Cars. Today we have in front of us this beautiful 2011 Audi Q5 Premium Plus all wheel drive sedan. Look at this SUV. Tell me that is not a good looking SUV. This one's finished in a deep sea blue metallic. Yes, that is the correct name for that beautiful blue. And it has a gorgeous light neutral leather interior really really nice SUV this is probably the first Q this is actually the first Q5 I've owned and I actually had this one for a minute um, I'm kind of slow sometimes getting cars done this one kind of got put to the side I actually drove it a bit last winter um, it runs awesome I put probably 500 miles on it just serviced it put a brand new alternator in it the windshield had a crack in it replaced that as well this is just a really really nice SUV how nice this is I'm definitely a fan of the Audis they are very very nice I do I'll probably sell a four cylinder but I'm definitely a fan of the 3.2 which is a six cylinder I think it's a really really great motor this one has really nice paint it looks to be all original it is the S line as well we're gonna go put it in the shade in a minute a beautiful day in New England it's a bit hot but I can't complain because I love it tell you one thing this this SUV this Audi has the, probably the coldest air conditioner out there it is freezing so this one does have the xenon headlights as well look at the condition of these headlights especially when I tell you the miles on this one headlights are absolutely gorgeous on it, it has the fog lights as well has that nice traditional Audi grille. Look at how nice that headlight is as well as the fog light. So I will tell everybody before we even get crazy into the video, this is a one owner vehicle. It does have a bunch of miles on it, but it was really, really well taken care of. Also, this will probably be the least expensive Q5 out there. So somebody's gonna get a really good deal on this one. This one just runs and drives and does everything the way it's supposed to. And I will show you guys all that as we get into the video further. But I just want to let everybody know that. And as always, guys, please take a second to like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Also, check me out on Facebook and Instagram, Elite Motor Cars, Peabody, Massachusetts. Look how clean this car is. SUV, car, truck, whatever you want to call it. I really enjoy driving this one. Everything works on this one. Now let me jump in. Now I'm going to show you guys some miles. And you guys are going to be like, wow. But this, this, I want to call it a truck. So I do have the one key there. I do have an additional key back at my business for this one as well. Let's jump in and take it for a ride. Always a little late to get my pictures done during the day. But that's me. What can you do? Awesome, awesome SUV. Now, I'm going to show you guys some miles. You guys can be like, oh my God. But this one, as a, it's a one owner. Always well maintained. Let me put my seatbelt on here. Give me a second. Here, guys. Give me a second. I'll take it for a little test drive here as well. So, as I was saying, this is a one owner vehicle always serviced at Audi and yes those are the miles 240,494 almost 500 so I put probably 500 miles on this um, the only thing I had to do was the alternator and the windshield had a crack and the alternator just wasn't charged as good as I wanted it to it was a little weak so I decided to change that as well I think I put a Bosch in it definitely put a good alternator in it um, just a really really nice SUV it runs beautiful shifts the way it's supposed to it does everything the way it's supposed to there's no service lights whatsoever everything works moonroof works everything Let's stop over here we'll check it out a bit more I'll show you guys all the nice options and this one is the s line as well i think most of them are the s line if i remember correctly this one has everything. It's got the navigation system. It's got the premium sound system. I'll show you guys everything in a second here. 
Well, over here, so I get a better view of everything. Actually, right over here would probably be the best to get everything good. One of those days trying to find the perfect place. So here we are. So this one does have the navigation right there. It has the information, which is for traffic updates. It has all the car information there as well. The setup is right there. This is all the control for all that. I think it's called, I don't know what it's called in the Audis. I know the BMWs, they call it I system. Radio right there as well. So it has all that. It does have dual zone climate control. The air conditioner and the heat both work perfectly and it has heated seats as well and those work perfect as well so everything works it has the automatic headlights it's got the controls on the steering wheel it's got the information center with mile per gallon and all that good thing all that good stuff the car is a car i'm stumbling over here it's 85 degrees crazy humidity out there so i got the air conditioner on so if you see any water underneath the car as we're doing the video that's from me and the air conditioner today the cup holder there as well it does have the tilt wheel as well and it's got all the basic stuff power windows power locks power seats memory seats lumbars and power rear hatch now let's open up the hood take a look underneath there open up the rear hatch as well as i mentioned earlier this one does have the 3.2 liter six cylinder i'm a big fan of this motor i think it's a great motor look at how clean this one is underneath the hood look at how clean it is smartest thing all the foreign cars do general motors would follow suit they'd be a lot easier to repair and maintain Now this one does have the original floor mats and I actually have back in my business, I have the rubber cargo mat for back here as well. And I also have a set of factory rubber mats as well. They're especially, uh, especially really good for the winter. If you use it in the snow, sleet, salt, it just keeps all the dirt off the floor mats. And you can see how nice these mats look. I mean, somebody really, really took care of this one. It's got the privacy cover there as well. It's got the nice magic button right there. Give that a little push and down it goes. Look at how beautiful this truck is. Now as far as I'm concerned, this one has all original paint. I don't see any paint work on it. I can't say I'm not missing something, but I don't see anything any place on this one. Let's check out the interior. The interior is just so nice on this one. I got the key right there. Let me get the key out of there so you won't keep seeing that blue tag right there. Steering wheel is exceptional. I mean, look how nice that steering wheel is. The gear shift, the console, none of this stuff's worn out. No cracks or tears. You see, these are usually worn out. Even when 100,000 miles, they're worn out. The dash is perfect. Absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful rugs as well. And look how nice this seat is. And before I forget to mention, it does have side airbags as well. I mean, there's hardly any wear on the upper cushion. A little cushion has a little bit of wear on the bolster right there, but that's definitely expected. But look how nice it is. Somebody really took care of this. Door panel is gorgeous, as you can see. It's got a cup holder on the door panel as well. Pretty cool. I'll show you guys one of my favorite parts too as we finish up the video. The rear seats do fold down for additional cargo space. Little magic lever right there. Give it a push and down it goes. And it will come down further. I have the seats back a little too much. So that will come all the way down. If you got to go to Home Depot, do a project, whatever it may be. Rear door panel is perfect as well. Just 
just as nice back here. This seat's exceptional. It really is. I don't think there was anybody in the back seat of this car much. It was just really, really well kept. Back of the kick panels of the seats are kicked and scuffed or nothing. This was definitely somebody's baby. And before I forget to show you the door panel back there as well. Just as nice. Awesome, awesome SUV. Pop it on this side. It's gorgeous. I don't know if this one has the owner's manual. I can't remember. And it does. And it's got the lock for the wheels as well. And somebody forgot to clean in there. Won't mention any names. Look how perfect it is. Look at this seat. This seat's in exceptionally nice condition. Like very, very minor wear, but that's about it. And the best thing is that beautiful moonroof, which I'll open up for you guys in a second. I love it. I love how you have a skylight in the back, the moonroof in the front. Just, it's awesome, I mean, especially if you're, this is a daily driver on a balmy evening like tonight, you open that sunroof up and totally enjoy. Now, here goes the tough part. I hate nitpicking them, but I gotta show you guys all the little marks on this one. And there's really, truly not a whole lot of marks on this one. This one was just really, really well cared for. I know I probably said that a million times in this video, but this one was really well cared for. It's got match, matching Michelin tires all around. These are not an inexpensive tire. The wheels, they have corrosion, they have scuffs, they have marks. They still look good, but they are far from perfect. Paint is beautiful, absolutely gleams. A couple minor stone chips in the front, but just minor stuff. Does have front and rear parktronics before I forget to mention it. And it also has, actually has a backup camera as well. A couple more stone chips right there as well. Just very minor stuff. Does have that light ding right there. Very minor, as you can see. The door's in great condition. Does have the directionals on the side for additional safety. A little scuff right there. A little scuff right there. Just very minor stuff there. A little scratch right there. Tiny little scuff right there. That bumper has a couple of scuffs and stuff being used. Especially down there. Biggest mark is right there. That little scuff right there. A couple of scuffs there. And a little ding right there as well. Couple scuffs there, and a couple scuffs there. A little chip right there, a little mark right there. You don't need to see my reflection all the time. A little scuff right there, tiny little mark right there. And also, let me show you guys the rest of the wheels. This one's in actually pretty good condition. Michelin tires are at least 75 80 percent on this one. And that wheel does have some corrosion. But just normal stuff, normal wear and tear type of stuff. Well, let's jump in it, take it around the block for a second. Let me show you guys the backup camera. We'll wrap up the video with this beautiful SUV. This is just an awesome truck. It is so humid out there today. It's beautiful, but it's so humid. It's crazy. And what happens with this one, before I forget, you push this in here. You push it in here before the break and start it right up. Let me show you guys the backup camera before I forget. There's the backup camera right there that works great. Great safety feature. This would probably be a great first time, first driver car. It would probably be perfect, safe, reliable, comfortable. And for the kids, it definitely, will, definitely looks the part. Really, really nice SUV. Show you guys that moonroof there as well. There we go. Like I said, everything works perfectly in this SUV. I keep wanting to call it a truck. And you give it a little more of a push right there and it goes all the way back. So awesome moonroof as well. Let's hop out, wrap it up guys, and I'm gonna go grab myself some ice cream.
That's what I feel like. Do one last walk around of this beautiful 2011 Audi Q5 Premium Plus 3.2 liter V6 all wheel drive quad pro. Beautiful truck, SUV. Told you I want to call them trucks. Has a nice dual exhaust there as well. Look at that moonroof. Perfect knife for the moonroof. Perfect knife. Well, as I mentioned earlier, yeah, this one does have a bunch of miles. It's a one owner SUV. It's just an awesome, awesome SUV. This is the type of SUV you could drive the wheels off of. You could probably get another 100,000 out of this, if not more. Somebody really, 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 I can't say really enough, took care of this one. This one will be priced way under book value. Probably be one of the least expensive on the market and probably one of the nicest ones in that price range. I will be asking $49.95 for this one. My name is George. You're welcome to give me a call. My direct line is 978-590-0014. Again, thank you so much for watching my videos. Enjoy the rest of your day.